Sean Comer reporting here from Lizzie Woolen, where Athlone Town have ensured they're taking the title race right down to the wire in the Women's National League with a narrow 1 0 win over Galway WFC here tonight. I suppose really not a lot of clear cut chances in this one for either side. The one that was taken ultimately was the cider. About 24 minutes in, a cross came in from the left, came from the boot of Madison Gibson into the Galway box. It ultimately fell down from Aaron Bavani, who took it first time, smashed it right into the back of the net. And really from there on in, there weren't a lot of chances worth talking about. I suppose Athlone had a few nervy moments defending. In the second half, Julianne Russell could have scored in the 49th minute when she dispossessed Kayleigh Shine and ran right through on goal. Uh, but backup goalkeeper Bonnie McKernan, who came in for the injured Neve Coombs and did absolutely brilliantly, uh, ensured that this stayed one in that long. There, like I said, few nervy moments defending, few crosses came into the box, could have gone anywhere. But I think McKernan and goals really kept her cool and was probably a big reason Athlone ended up seeing this one out. They never looked like scoring a second goal, but Galway also never really looked like, I suppose apart from the Russell chance, getting another clear cut chance. So Athlone now next week, with the result against Piemont and Wexford Dukes, uh, ensure that the title is a possibility, but they would have to go to a playoff against Shelburne if they beat both in Dalymount next week. And the game uh, between Wexford Dukes and Shelburne ends up a draw. Piemont now, of course, are out of the picture. So full time here in Lizzie Woolen, it's Athlone Town 1, Galway WFC 0.